Hello, my friends. Welcome back to the channel. Yes. Yeah, so if you're like me, you probably need some hardstone shards. I went to upgrade my shield and my bow and I had zero. And so I saw on the wiki that the hoplites actually drop them, uh, which are the ooze things with the shields that throw the spears. So come to the archstone, the Lord's path. It's the archstone that you unlock after you beat the phalanx boss, which is the boss that's a giant blob surrounded by hoplites. Anyway, um, one little tip, if you, whenever you're farming, if you have the providential ring, put that on. It's a it's a ring you can have as your starting gift. Um, if you don't have it, look it up in the wiki. I, I don't know if you you'll be able to get it, but anyway, this will help you uh, farm a little bit faster, and just in general if you're farming, not just this method. Um, okay, so we're gonna just continue down the path, uh, and while we're walking down the path. Um, I don't know if this is the best best method, but early game I don't I don't think there's another mes method that's better early game because you can't really unlock anything else. I guess I should reset it, but you can't really unlock anything else until you complete this boss because this is the first boss that kind of unlocks the rest of the game for you. So you should have this is the only or the first boss that you'll have. But anyway, let me reset it real quick. It's actually not too bad though. I I did two runs and I have eight shards now so not too bad but anyway um i'm using kind of a, a night build but if you are a magic user fire works really good on these things but i can just one hit him with the sword and i'm just trying to be like quick And of course, because we're uh, doing this video live, I haven't gotten any yet. But usually, like, two of them will drop it. There's, that's probably one. There it is, Hearthstone Shard. Come on. Ah, you suck. Alright, well, I got one, but as you can see, it's still really fast. So we'll just reset it and run it again real quick and see if we have better luck. Make sure we didn't miss any. But because it, the reason that I think that this is going to be the best early game way is because there's no other mobs in there. And these, those things are like really easy to deal with. Like, let's be honest, they're, uh, they're pretty simple. Even if you don't have an OP weapon, just shoot them with a, a fire spell or something and, or uh, roll behind them and hit them with your weapon. All right, better luck this time. Here's to hoping. Come on, there's one. They also... Oh, so they drop sharp stone as well, by the way. But they drop the hard stone more often. Yeah, hard stone. But times two, baby. Times two, that ring, I'm telling you. All right, one more time. Oh, wait, oh, we missed one. One more time. One more, t one time more. Run, 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 run. Reset it real quick. The one thing I wish that this was more like Dark Souls, where, like, when you touch the arch, I guess it would fundamentally change the game, though. But I do like how in Dark Souls, when you touch the bonfire, it. Uh, like goes into the smoke and resets the world, but I guess they didn't want to. They didn't want to change it too much. I mean, they improved a lot of systems with the remake, but I'm guessing they didn't want to fundamentally change the game. Which I guess that's just a preference. But there's another set of two. Come on. All right, come on, give me one. I rolled too early. Ah, oh, you didn't give me one, bruh. All right, well, we did a few runs, but let's just see. So we started with eight when I started the video. Video is at less than five minutes, and we have 16. So we doubled. We we got eight in the you know, and we got one 
or two sharp stones. So that's not too bad. Plus, at the beginning of the video, I was kind of rambling a little bit. So as you can see, if you really want to farm them, spend like 30 minutes doing this. And let's say you average eight every five minutes. 30 minutes is, you know, 30 times five is six. So six times eight is what? 40. Six times eight is 48. So I think 48, right? So 48 shards in half an hour, 90 shards, you know, 96 shards in, in an hour if you really wanted to farm. So that's not too bad. But anyway, uh, if this was helpful, please like, subscribe, and until next time, thanks for watching.